Good evening, everybody. This is Scott with another great episode of Pest Plus in the News. I'm here with Brian. How are you, Brian? All right. Nice How are to you? see you. Good. So it's 7.13 in the evening. We're here in Plainsboro. What the heck are we doing here, man? Oh, man. Uh, I spent a couple late nights with um, something in the wall keeping us in the dog very awake. Uh, some kind of noise going on, something jumping around, it sounded like. Um, so I called uh, a number of companies and uh, got varying prices from... Uh, very expensive to very, very expensive, and uh, estimates as uh, as short as a, a week out, but obviously it's something I wanted to take care of right away, um, with the wife and the baby, and, and obviously a very active dog in the house. Now you had, one guy came out here from an exterminating company, and he walked around just inside. Yeah, he looked around, kind of knocked on the wall, that was about it, he didn't hear anything. He talked more than he listened to me, uh, more than he even listened to the wall. Um, of course, nothing was replicated at the time anyway, but he just kind of talked and talked, um, spewed some numbers at me, that's about it. So now you, you called me this morning, mm -hmm. you said you wanted to have it taken care of by today. I told you I'd be here today, and now here we are. We, uh, we talked on the phone, we decided that we'd have to open up the wall to do exploratory scenes, and uh, we opened up one corner wall, we found a bunch of dead old mice. And then we opened up another section in which a, a live mouse ran out, which then we had to tear the bedroom apart. Right. And to catch that live mouse, and then we opened up, we found some more dead mice, and then we opened up the corner wall in which we didn't find anything. Mm -hmm. And uh, then we went outside. As you know, I did a little observation. I noticed that where the lines are coming in from the AC units, that's where I believe the entry points are. There are two holes, they're not secured. We went in and we used something called Stuff It, which is a copper mesh for made for rodents, and then, you know, you're going to apply or reach out to the association and put Stuff It. Yeah. So, you know, you, we appreciate you giving a, a testimonial. We put this on our website. Potentially millions of people see this way they, they see about us. What would you have to say to our potential audience or somebody looking to hire a pest plus based upon your experience so far? Just very, very pleased overall. Um, got somebody live on the phone right away. Uh, I got a call back very quickly, um, talked me through the issue on the phone, um, gave me a great estimate, and uh, the final cost was very close to that, which was still under all the numbers that I got from all the other companies I, I've been calling in the past that's three days. Right. Very pleased. Thank you. Well, you also had a concern. You said, what happens in the future if they come back? And I said, if it does happen, just give us a call. We'll address it then because we never leave anybody hanging. So thank you very much. We appreciate it. We hope you can get a good night's sleep. And if you like, Brian, you know, don't choose the rest. Just choose the best. Scott and Wendy Pest Plus, 732-777-6857. Until next time, sayonara. Say sayonara. 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 sayonara.